Hi. Um, I've been taking apart my uh, Panasonic Viera TV, um, part number TX32LZD85. Um, there's absolutely no power um, coming on. There's no red light when you push the power switch on the bottom left uh, corner at the front. Um, so I've taken it apart and this is what I've found. <laughs> so this main board here in the middle is the power board. Um, so this is where the problem turned out to be. If I take you in a bit, there's these um, optocouplers in the centre of the screen there, that little four pin device. Um, that is used to feed back the voltage on the 5 volt side back to the power supply and there's a fault with that which I'll show you how to diagnose. Okay, so the cause of my problem is that the 5 volt line is um, down at 3 volts. Um, it's quite a common problem, I think I've seen a couple of other videos where people have described this. Um, so you need to measure the voltage relative to one of the um, screws, screw holes used to connect the board to the chassis. Uh, and if you measure where you can see in the picture, you should get 5 volts. Uh, now I'm getting like two, just under 3, 2.8, 2.9. Okay, unplug the mains power from the TV and we will take some measurements to check that it is this component uh, PC7000, the optocoupler, that is faulty. Um, there's an identical device, PC7001, a couple of inches away on the board, so we should be able to compare the two and check whether they are different. Okay, I'm taking a resistance measurement across the opto transistor pins of the other optocoupler, the PC7001. As you can see, it's 28.5 megabytes. On taking the same measurement across the same pins on the PC7000 optocoupler, the resistance was about 500 ohms. So this um, transistor was failed with a short circuit uh, effectively. Now this is the part of the circuit diagram that we're interested in. Um, it's just for information really, you don't need to know uh, the detail of this, but I downloaded this from manualslib.com. It's actually for the TX37LZD80F, so if you search for that you should find the service manual. Um, so if you want to do any more digging, if, this, if you didn't have the same fault as I had and you want to do some more investigation, it's really essential to have. Um, so you can see in this, we've got the uh, regulator chip IC7000 that has the, um, effectively pin 4 gets dragged low when the optocoupler uh, transistor gets um, energised. I'm guessing IC7001 is a precision voltage source, so um, when the 5 volt rail is a certain amount above it, it energizes that photodiode. Obviously in our case we've got this fault with the um, phototransistor going short, so the um, IC7000 thinks that it's already supplying enough voltage, so it's pulling back down to uh, 3 volts. So hopefully by replacing this photo, um, this opto isolator, we should solve this problem. Um, I've had a look on the internet for some equivalents because I couldn't find the actual part itself. If I manage to find it, I will um, post the equivalent in the notes below.